What's going on guys? Mike with Tiger Supplies and today we're going over Leica's Crossline Laser, the Lino L6. Uh, this is probably the brightest green bean Crossline Laser on the market and we're going to go over some of the tips and tricks to get you up and running quickly. So let's jump right into it. So we're going to show you how to light up all three windows on your Crossline Laser. Uh, first things first, you're going to want to hit that power button. Now, there's one lever you're going to have to notice here, and it's the self-leveling lock. When it is on the locked position, you'll notice that when I push the power button to move to the next window, it only illuminates one window at a time, okay? So in order to get all three of the windows to illuminate in this cross-line laser, you have to unlock it from its self-leveling position, and then you'll actually just press through it twice. We'll get two of them. And then if you go three times through, you'll get all three lit. Okay, so your first tip in terms of how to get all three uh, cross beam windows to illuminate is to unlock the self-leveling and then press accordingly to how many line lasers you need. Next thing I want to go over is the fine adjustment knob. Um, this is really cool. What it'll allow you to do is get uh, about a 10 degrees worth of fine tune adjustments. And this comes in handy when you're using the laser at far distances because uh, if you're using this line laser across the room, one little touch can really move it, let's say an inch. So this knob right here is meant just for that. And uh, we're gonna show you on a specific angle. I'm barely rotating this, but I'm about maybe 30 feet and you could say me moving this Half a rotation actually moves the line almost one inch. So um, yes, for, for fine tune adjustments, you're gonna wanna use this knob. Right, so next thing we wanna show you is how to replace the battery. With the Lycolino L6 series, you actually get two types of batteries. The alkaline, which is your standard you know, AA batteries, and then you get the rechargeable. And switching is really easy. So first thing you wanna do is make sure that the unit is off. You're actually just going to pop out the back like so. And in this case, I have my rechargeable. And then right here is my alkaline pack. If I had the batteries, I would actually just put them in. It takes three AAAs. And boom, now I'm actually ready to go. So this is really nice for job sites where maybe you forgot to recharge the batteries. Hey, no worries, we have the backups with the AA batteries. 